The linked spreadsheet method is a very handy method if the payoff calculations are done in a calculation template separate from the tree itself. In this template, you calculate the bottom line, the net payoff, based on various inputs. These calculations can be simple or complex. In fact, this method is most useful when the calculations are rather complex. Then in the tree, you create two types of links. First, in the model settings dialog, you designate the cell in your calculation template where your bottom line is stored. Second, in the tree itself, you designate cells containing specific input values that you want to be plugged into the calculation template. The model shown here explains this procedure in more detail. It is the same model as described in the payoff formula video. The objective is again to choose the merchant, A or B, with the smallest total expected cost. The two merchants differ in two ways. First, they have different discount rates, 3.25 for merchant A and 4.00 for merchant B. And second, they have different shipping costs, 1550 and 1450 for carriers one and two for merchant A, and $17 and 1550 for carriers one and two for merchant B. These inputs have been entered below the branches of the decision tree. To implement the linked spreadsheet method, create the tree in the usual way as shown here. Specifically, enter the constants for merchants A and B as just indicated. Second, create the calculation template shown in the boxed in area using appropriate business logic. The black cells are common to each merchant. The two blue cells vary across merchants. In the template, you can enter any values in the blue cells. At this point, they are basically placeholders. Next, in the Model Settings dialog box, select Linked Spreadsheet as the calculation method. This has already been done. This provides link updating and default cell boxes. Select Automatic for link updating and select the total cost cell, C7, in your calculation template for the default cell. This instructs Precision Tree to get the net payoff, actually a cost in this model, for each path through the tree from cell C7 of the calculation template. Also, don't forget to select Minimum Payoff in the Optimum Path box. We want the minimum expected cost in this model. Next, click the green decision node. Select cell C4, which has already been done, as the cell to link branch values to. This instructs Precision Tree to enter each of the branch values, 3.25% and 4.0%, into cell C4 of the calculation template, right here, when it calculates the total costs of the various paths. Similarly, click each of the red chance nodes and select cell C6 as the cell to link branch values to. This has already been done. Again, this instructs Precision Tree to enter the values in these branches into cell C6 of the calculation template when it calculates total costs on the various paths. That's all there is to it. You can check that the blue dollar amounts to the right of the end nodes are the correct total costs. For example, if you enter 3.25% and 1550 into cell C4 and C6, the total cost in cell C7 will be 257.38. Again, one advantage of the linked spreadsheet method is that the calculation template can be as complex as you like. All it requires is one or more inputs, those you get from the tree, that lead to a bottom line net payoff. Another advantage is that it is fairly transparent. You see the logic in the calculation template. 